Welcome, dear viewers, to Elabiad TV. In this exciting episode, we will accompany our distinguished scientific team, composed of Dr. Mohammed Elabiad, his wife, Dr. Ayman, engineer Abdel Rahman, the loyal dog, Junior, and the magician, Joseph. Our team has recently completed a fascinating research journey in ancient Egyptian temples, uncovering astounding secrets of ancient science. But their adventure doesn't end here. Now, they embark on a new mission to respond to one of the most controversial claims. Is the Earth flat? Let's dive together into this thrilling scientific exploration. Dr. Mohammed El Abayad began by examining the ancient hieroglyphs filled with intricate astronomical symbols and said, For thousands of years, the ancient Egyptians observed the movement of stars and planets. They had a vision of the universe and knew that the Earth wasn't flat. But the question is, how can some people today still ignore this truth? Dr. Ayman, holding an ancient book filled with astronomical drawings by the Egyptians, continued, the ancient Egyptians had a complex mathematical system that enabled them to precisely calculate the movement of celestial bodies. They wouldn't have been able to construct these temples and solar calendars if they didn't understand that the Earth is spherical. Engineer Abdel Rahman, specializing in Egyptian architecture, added, From our study of ancient Egyptian engineering, it's clear that their understanding of symmetry and their use of gravity concepts were no coincidence. If the Earth were flat, they wouldn't have needed such precise engineering to determine the positions of the sun and stars accurately. Then magician Joseph, with his deep knowledge of ancient sciences, added, in ancient times, magic was used to understand the natural world. But even magic cannot deny the scientific facts we see before us. The continuous movement of stars and the shifting constellations in the sky can only be explained if the Earth is spherical and rotating on its axe. Standing in front of a whiteboard filled with diagrams, Dr. Mohammed El Abayad said, Modern science has confirmed what the Egyptians knew thousands of years ago. We now have a refutable evidence from space. Astronauts aboard the International Space Station have seen the Earth as a sphere from space. This is an undeniable fact. Dr. Iman explained further, It's not just ancient engravings. Modern science has provided us with concrete proof. Satellites send us daily images of our planet clearly showing its spherical shape. Also, the phenomenon of day and night would be impossible if the Earth were flat, as the sun illuminates different parts of the Earth based on its rotation. Engineer Abdel Rahman offered another practical example. The gradual disappearance of ships over the horizon is one of the most powerful pieces of evidence for the Earth's curvature. When you see a ship disappearing bit by bit, you're actually witnessing the Earth's curve. Dr. Iman added another point related to physics. If the Earth were flat, gravity would work in an irregular pattern. Gravity depends on the mass of the planet, and its spherical shape ensures equal gravitational pull around the planet. This has been measured precisely with satellites and ground-based instruments. Even the loyal dog Junior seemed to be following the team's discussions closely, as if confirming the truth that the Earth is indeed round. Magician Joseph, with his wise smile, added, Even ancient magic never contradicted modern science. The truth remains the same across time and space. Next, the team conducted some scientific experiments to demonstrate the Earth's curvature through natural phenomena. Dr. Mohammed El had used a telescope to explain, When we observe the movement of stars and planets, we see that their motions are entirely consistent with the Earth being spherical. The stars shift their positions in the sky depending on where you are on Earth. Dr. Iman, using a globe model and a light source, demonstrated a simple experiment showing how the sun illuminates half of the Earth at a time, explaining why we have day and night. If the Earth were flat, the sun would illuminate the entire planet at once, which we know doesn't happen in reality. Engineer Abdel Rahman continued with his own experiments. Gravity on Earth's surface is almost equal in all directions due to the spherical shape of the Earth. If the Earth were flat, gravitational effects would be completely different. After presenting the evidence, the team addressed some of the common arguments made by flat Earth proponents. 
Dr. Mohammed El Abayad said, one of the most popular claims is that water doesn't curve. But this is a misunderstanding. Water follows the curvature of the Earth due to gravity, which you can clearly see at the horizon. Dr. Iman added, another argument is that planes don't adjust their flight paths while flying over a supposedly flat Earth. But this is inaccurate. Pilots use navigational systems that continuously adjust according to the Earth's curvature to ensure safe flights. Engineer Abdel Rahman pointed out, the absence of noticeable curvature over short distances is often cited as evidence. But it's important to understand that the Earth is massive and curvature isn't easily visible over short distances. At the end of this deep scientific discussion, Dr. Mohammed El Abayad said, after all this evidence, no one can deny that the Earth is spherical. This is not just a modern scientific fact, but a truth known for thousands of years, from the ancient Egyptians to today's scientists. Dr. Iman added, the evidence before us, whether from space or scientific experiments, leaves no room for doubt. Engineer Abdel Rahman concluded, science is our pathway to truth. With every experiment, we come closer to understanding the universe around us. Finally, magician Joseph, with his calm demeanor, said, even ancient magic acknowledges the truth. The universe is vast, and its secrets are discovered only through science and knowledge. Dr. Mohammed El Abai had wrapped up the episode by saying, this scientific journey was exhilarating, but our adventure doesn't end here. In our next mission, we will dive deep into the oceans to explore the mysteries of the deep waters. Stay tuned for the next episode of our team's thrilling adventures.